everyone. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Um, I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Uh, if you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same-day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back fairly quickly. Also on the website, jamiezebra23.com, I've got full-size candles, do-it-yourself love kits, protection kits, prosperity kits. Crystal stones, pendants, Florida water, Florida water soap, incense sage, protection bracelets, pendulums for divination and prophecy. I also have a 10-minute tarot card reading for $25. It's not the reading special. This is something different. This is something that will be on the website every day from now on on jamiezebra23.com. Also, um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Keep in mind that the readings are general, so this is not, they are not personal readings, so they may or may not resonate. So please be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising videos for further insight. Also, keep in mind... Um, that um, you must place an order before I can schedule you. So there's no need to email me and ask me what's on the website when you can simply go to the website and check yourself, right? So, um, and if you have any questions about the items on my website, you simply go to the description box of the item on the website and it tells you the times, the dates, um, when you should hear back from me, what the protocol is, all of that can simply be found by just going to the website and looking at the description. All right, guys, uh, please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Ta-ta for now. Hi everyone, it's Jamie Zebra 23. I'm doing your tarot card of the day for May 14th, 2021, moving forward. So let's see what the energies are. Okay, so we got the lover's card in the reverse, a mistake, foolish designs. Somebody's regretful. Somebody feels like they missed out. And then the sun. Somebody feels like um, right when all the good stuff started happening, they're out of the picture. Like somebody feels like I stuck it out with you for a long time and... Or I should have waited longer. So for some of each, each of you, it's going to be for something different. For some of you, there's somebody who's thinking, wow, you know, I, I shouldn't have jumped ship just yet. I should have stuck around. If I would have stuck around, my life would have been different. So I don't know. Maybe somebody still looks good. Maybe somebody's still, you know, maybe somebody's very financially stable. Maybe somebody hit the jackpot. You know, maybe somebody's career. Maybe they, they finished school and now they got a good career. Somebody's wishing that they could be a part of whatever you got going on. Expect um, expect for exes to be contacting you guys. We are we are um, going to be in Mercury retrograde shadow period. I guess today it officially starts for everybody, but for most of us, we've already been feeling the energy. Okay, so expect to hear from um, most likely a fire sign, a Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries, but there could also be a Gemini involved, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio involved. Big emphasis on Leo. Big emphasis on Leo and um, uh, Gemini. Let's see what else. Yeah, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Either way, I, I look. It looks like somebody's gonna be turning their back. Even if somebody, it's like even if they love you, they're still gonna. Somebody's gonna turn their back. They're gonna be like, you know what? You're no good for me. Even if I do have feelings for you, even if I do want to be with you, you're no good for me. I can't. I can't, and I won't. Okay, so now. Let's talk about something else. So now let's look at this different. Okay, somebody is coming back around to tell you that they made a mistake. I feel like somebody wants to come back around. So let's say nobody did anything wrong to you. Let's say you were seeing someone, talking to someone, hoping it would go somewhere, and they just ghosted you or told you that they were not ready yet. You know, no infidelity, no craziness, no lying, no drama, no narcissism, nothing weird. It's just two two people who are mutually respecting each other decided, you know what, now is not a good time. I got too much going on and so do you. That person's now coming back around to say, okay, I'm ready for a commitment. I'm ready to do this if you are. You know, I've worked out my issues. I've thought about it. I've missed you. I've been thinking about you. They want to have an honest chance with you. But I feel like for some of you, even though this person's being honest and they're coming back honestly, some of you, maybe you're already seeing someone else by now or you feel like, yeah, I, you know, I don't, I don't have those feelings for you anymore. And if you're this quick to drop me, like I'm nothing, I, when is the next time you're going to feel like you got too much going on? So there's a distrust here. Somebody can't trust it. But I feel like this is genuine. Who's ever coming back would be, this is a genuine thing. They really do want to do this with you. Now, with the Queen of the Queen of Swords here, which could very well be a king, I do feel like somebody, it's like, if I can't have what I want, I don't want anything at all. Like, if, if you're not going to be my boyfriend again, my girlfriend again, my husband again, my wife again, I don't want it. 
or I have my sights set on someone else, even though all of you are asking me out, even all of you, I'm getting all these attention, all these women are calling me and texting me, all these guys are calling me and texting me. I know exactly what it is that I want. I know what will make me happy. And I'm going to be the ice king or the ice queen until I get that. Until this person comes back to me, I know we're going to reunite. I know we're going to do it big. So somebody's not giving up on the person that they love, even if the person that they love has given up on them. Lots of romance here tonight. So with the Knight of Swords and the King of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune, somebody wants access to you. You are their Wheel of Fortune. Whether they just love who you are as a person, whether they love your bank account, your physical appearance, maybe they love your D, maybe they love your V. Either way, somebody's charging in. They're like, uh-uh, not so fast. Not so fast, sweet cheeks. You're not getting away from me. You're not getting out of my grip. <laughs> You know, you can run, but you can't hide kind of energy. So somebody's not letting this go. Now let's talk about something else. I feel like you guys are happy. I feel like for the most part, most of you are happy. Um, even if you're single, you're like, I'm happy. You know, I'm not trying to change a dang thing. Like, I'm I'm good. Like, I'm good over here. Like, you know, I've got my routine. I got my setup. I got my life. I, you know, I got my core friends. I, I hang out with so-and-so on this day and we go have coffee on that day. We, I go drink wine and dance with my friends on this day. Like somebody's got their whole life set just fine and they don't want anybody coming in and messing that up. So I do feel like for some of you, there, you may have romantic suitors charging in to be with you. But you're just like, I don't, you know, that doesn't, that Shania Twain, Twain song, that don't impress me much. So these guys have to come with it. Like, they can't just have a good hairdo. They can't just have a nice car. You know, they can't, they, they need more. They, they gotta, they gotta, they gotta be like you, basically. They gotta fit your, your, your um, criteria. If they don't, then you just can't. You're not, you're only taking applicants that are qualified. Yeah. If you're not qualified, need not apply. Yeah. So for some of you, you're just like, I'm I'm the Wheel of Fortune. I'm expecting to get the Wheel of Fortune in return. Like, I'm, I want to match. Some of you have realized, you know, if it's not going to work if this person is not your match. So now I want to, um, even though this isn't about the tarot card of the day, I just want you guys to be aware of this because there's still a lot of, you know, I only knew about narcissism. I mean, I've heard the word over the years, but I only knew about this since 2020. Like going, well, actually going into, so leaving 2019, going into 2020. So I, I have been having an experience on the internet where I have um, love bombing, devaluing, the attempted discard, the hovering, then the love bombing, then the devaluing, and then the attempted discard with someone on the internet. Um, I'm, you know, I'm not engaging at all. So it's kind of like, oh yeah, you're the end all be all. You're so amazing, Jamie. You know, this and that. You know, I'm trying to make you mine. Then then it's, um, what are you freaking out about now? There's not going to be a gas shortage. Nothing's going on. What are you freaking out about now? Do, are you always this loud? Are you always this flashy? If so, that's going to be a problem. But the day before... I was amazing in all of these things. As we figured out now, there was literally the day after my dream that I posted, literally it happened. So there's many places without gas currently. There's literally a gas crisis and it's only going to get worse. Doesn't mean that there will never have gas again, but there's going to be a crisis for a little while. You know, a lot of things are going to slow down for a little while and a lot of prices are going to go up for a little while. It's just what's going to happen. Um... It's going to be fine. It's going to work itself out. But, you know, people should be topping off their gas if they even have gas at the gas stations where, they're, where they are locally. Because there's a lot of places that do not. Um, so for those of you, so now the reason why I'm mentioning any of this stuff is because some of you have exes that are coming back and you've not, you've not uh, learned the game just yet. For you guys, you're like, well, that's kind of weird. You know, yeah, yesterday he was saying I was great or she was saying I was great because girls can be narcissists too. So, yeah, so-and-so was telling me I was great yesterday. Now today I'm good for nothing and I can't do anything right and I'm just drama and crazy and no good. Then they stopped talking to me. Then I'm everything in the world, the end-all, be-all, 
then the devalue starts, then the discard, then the hovering, then it's 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 a cycle. It's an and narcissists love the the retrograde period to pull their crap. So you know, I did not engage in any of the things that were going on on the internet. I just literally put question marks and weird emojis. I didn't even engage because it was just too, it was too obvious what was going on. But um, but see, that's like a, a prime example of narcissism. So ladies and gentlemen, when your narcissist exes pop back up during this retrograde, pay attention. You know, pay attention to the, you know, the love bombing. The love bombing is, oh, you're the best thing that ever happened to me. This time it's going to work. I want to marry you. I want to be with you forever. You're, you're the one. Then the devalue starts. You can't do anything right. You're just dumb. You're drama. You're over the top. Can't you tone it down? You're no good. Everything you do is wrong. Okay? Then the discard comes in where they just stop communicating or they just throw you away um, if you don't discard them first. Um, if you know these signs, it would be better just not to entertain these people. Then they do it all over again. It's oh, it's always a rotation. So when they're not talking to you, they're dealing with someone else. When they're done dealing with that person, they go to the next until it's your turn again. So a lot of you, it's it's about to be your turn again. For some of you, you like that, and and this is fun for you, and you know you're like at least they called, you know at, at least I got them for a week out of the month. Cool. If, if that's what you want, it looks like your dreams are coming true. But if this is not something that you guys want, then I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't entertain this over and over again. But anyway, TammySeeper23.com, if you guys have ordered a $10 one question, one answer via email only or a same day reading and you've not heard from me within about 45 minutes, feel free to email me to let me know so I can hurry up and answer your questions, hurry up and do your readings. Also, the reading special is still going on for a few more hours on TammySeeper23.com. Just keep in mind, reading specials are done in seven to 10 days after purchase. If you don't want to wait seven to 10 days after purchase to get a reading special, you can always order a same day reading, which is done the same day, or you can order a regular reading, which is done in 24 to 72 hours after purchase. And, and, um, I've got a second tarot card channel. It's Jamie Zebra 23 chat. If you guys want to, um, go over, like, share, subscribe, and comment. That would be super duper lovely. Also, um, I'm available 365 days a year, seven days a week. That includes Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, all holidays, every day. Yep, yep, jamiezebra23.com to talk for now. Hey everyone, it's jamiezebra23. Sorry to interrupt the reading, but if you guys are interested in a personal reading, you can simply go to the first 30 seconds of this video, and it tells you um, where to make a purchase, jamiezebra23.com. It tells you about the same day reading, so you don't have to wait, same day readings. Also an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. Plus I've got tons of products on the website for protection, for cleansing, for energetic healing, all sorts of goods on the website, jamiezebra23.com. You simply go to the first 30 seconds of the video and it will explain all of this stuff. No need to email me to ask me if I do personal readings when you can simply go to the first 30 seconds and also the description box says it too. jamiezebra23.com, enjoy the rest of your reading. Hi everyone, it's Jamie Zebra 23 so I have a fans-only account if you guys want to skip over there and um, check it out. It's uh, pretty much for guys. Um, it's not that raunchy, but it may be a little bit of fun. Jamie Zebra 23 ta-ta for now.